Hello YouTube watchers, my name is Walt Willows and welcome back to my show. And now I'm going to show you my favorite places to farm souls in Dark Souls 3. I mainly try to earn souls by killing all the enemies that I can find throughout the game, by exploring the game. I don't try to uh, farm all that much like some other players do, mainly because I find it like a chore, even though this game is fun, even to farm me here, because this game is awesome. You will eventually need to farm souls if you want to buy stuff, if you want to upgrade your weapons, or if you want to level up um, so you can beat a tough enemy that you were having problems with. So let's go and visit the places I'm going to recommend you. But of course I'm using the Faram set armor. Of course I'm dressed as the guy on the Dark Souls 2 cover art. Mainly because I like the way that this thing looks. But I, I throughout the game I use the, the, the knight armor set. Mainly because I think it's very well balanced. Many people like to use more fancier web, uh, armor, and so most of the players prefer to to rather be naked or use the um, the, the the very loose clothing because of the weight, the stamina, and all that kind of stuff. So let's go. I'm going to show you first my level if you just want to know. I'm with the Covenant Way of the Blue. I don't really care because I don't play online. Um, and my level is 100, 113 and I need this much, uh, this amount of souls to level up to get to the 114 level and if of course as you might know in this game whenever you level up you need more and more souls to level up and this is the amount of souls I need and I get them easily you not really that hard so let's go so this is my favorite place in Dark Souls. Road of Fact Sacrifices, you go to the bonfire that is called Farron Keep. And yeah, that's the, this is my favorite place to farm uh, souls because the, the level design is very good. The, the enemies that we find here, they give you a good amount of souls and all, kind of, all that kind of stuff. I'm just joking, this place sucks. This is my favorite place to farm souls in Dark Souls 3, mainly because the enemies that you will find here, they will give you a good amount of souls by killing them. I would recommend you to first visit all the bonfires first, mainly because this place is kinda, uh, they, the enemies are kinda tough, uh, tough, and, and yeah, and for me at least, a spoiler alert, uh, I find, I, I think that the boss that you will find at the end of the road here is one of the hardest boss in this game and that's a really good boss here i'm going to tell you who he is but yes this is my fair place to farm souls so visit here if you want to farm souls in dark souls 3 let's go to another place now by the way, this is my favorite sword that I use in this game, and it's called the Irithyll Straight Sword, and it's of course, of course, upgraded. And this Shield of Wands, I used to use this Shield of Wands, and uh, I use this Twin Dragon Red Shield a lot too, as well. I have these heavier, more protective shields, if I want to use them against tougher enemies, but. 
I tend not to use shields that much anyways so this is my favorite place or another place that I like to form here and of course you might know this what the name is and of course it's the high wall of Lodric it's just the very beginning of the game the enemies in here are they are really easy and of course you don't get all, all of that all that much souls by farming here but they are easy at the beginning and they will give you a good amount of souls and there's also a place here I you won't see it anymore uh, but there's a place that there's a dragon that the dragon throws fires to the enemies and you, you can get a good amount of um, souls by doing that thing Le leave, leave the the dragon kill everyone for you so that's my uh, another second place to go let's show you my third place to go And I'm back here on the refill of the Boreal Valley. I already show you and I already tell you that this is my favorite place to farm souls. Mainly the route that you will find around there, not going in, in here. But in here, if you go to this farm bonfire, um, if you already know that bonfire, of course, you can go here. I will show you. And th you will find here a good. Uh, amount of enemies and they will give you a very good amount of souls by killing them and you can always with patience go back here reset all of them with the bonfire and go back again to farm a little more I will show you the route that I use here I don't go to all the places I'm usually going to show you what I do here I come here I go there where the stairs are and I go up the bridge I kill all the priests because they they have a projectile attack and I go and kill all of them I go down the stairway and I kill both of the giants there they are not that tough you just have to be careful and stay around their feet I mainly kill them just when they want to get up and that's just very easy so you can come here as well this is all for now thank you for watching and leave me in the comment section below your favorite favorite places to farm souls in Dark Souls 3 and have a great day farming souls good day and good night